first things first I appreciate your support so uh, this is a Samsung washing machine eh? that uh, was stopping mid cycle in fact cotton wasn't moving but on spin it was running but emitting sparks at the bottom so if you can check in you will see the machine sparking so if you notice a machine sparking from the bottom that is sparks from the motor so i automatically knew that something was wrong with the motor and the common problem with the motor when it comes to sparking is the carbon brushes when the carbon brushes are worn out the machine will start sparking and this was the and this was the case sorry so let's get into it so i, I had to power off the machine so if you're planning to work on your machine always make sure the machine has been powered off because you don't have to get yourself electrocuted or something so always 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 power off your machine then also remove switch off the turn off the pipes switch off the taps ensure water is not running remove the pipe then you go to go so i'm just doing that because enough droplets of water can go on the motor and then cause more damage so if you check here this is soot so when a machine is emitting soot that means that the carbon brushes are worn out so what i did is just remove the drive belt when you remove the drive belt now you remove the screws on the motor which is simple the same procedure that i'm doing here remove the belt then get the right spanner for the job so on motor most of the time it's number 10. so i used my number 10 to remove the motor on the samsung eco bubble washing machine so let's have a look at it so once the screws are out you disconnect the wiring harness that runs from the motherboard to the motor itself and there's the motor it's quite heavy so yeah I'm a fit guy <laughs> so you you have to be careful because you don't have to bang it you don't want it to bang it down so that's the motor checking the motor there is still suit on the motor so you can't know if the brushes are worn out unless you check with the multimeter which you might not have be having by then you'll have to remove the screws and there we go very short so how does it spark on the carbon casing it's metallic so when it's worn out when the brush is worn out the metallic casing on the brush touches the armature now that's uh, metal to metal so imagine it's running at high speed spinning like on a thousand revolution per minute and it's metal to metal what happens you start seeing sparks so that's the reason why you see sparks on a washing machine that uses a drive belt. So uh, this is my advice. The moment you see soot on your washing machine, immediately power it off and get in a technician. Because that is sparks. That will lead to sparks that is a clear indicator that the machine brushes are worn out if you don't do that you might end up replacing the entire motor which is a common issue that you've dealt with and if that unlucky the motor will short the motherboard now the machine becomes a scrub so don't play yourself so this is the full procedure 